Hello friends! If you are seeing this error, your device ran into a problem and need to restart Windows or Blue Serene error, then do watch this video till end, because in this video, I will share three methods to solve this problem. Let's get started. Method 1 is to perform a hard reboot. For that, press or hold power button for 10 to 15 seconds so that all the power stored drain from your PC or laptop. After 15 seconds, leave the power button, wait for a few seconds, and then turn on your PC or laptop. See your laptop or PC working or not? If still you're seeing this error, then try the second method. In the second method, we are going to repair the Windows Corrupt System files, because sometimes Windows Corrupt System files may occur on this type of error. For that, you need to open Windows Advanced Startup Options. For that, turn off and on your laptop or PC three times to trigger Windows Automatic Repair. This process will take you to Windows Advanced Repair Options. Click on See Advanced Repair Options. After that, click on Troubleshoot. Click on Advanced Options. Now, here, click on Command Prompt. This will open Command Prompt windows in front of you. Type Command SFC slash scan OW, and then press Enter key. This command will start repair Windows Corrupt files. Wait till command execute 100%. After that, type check disk slash of slash RC, and then press Enter key. This will check your hard drive for any error and repair it. Wait till command executed 100%. Once both command executed successfully, close the command prompt and then click on continue. See your laptop or PC now working or not. If the error still persists, then move to third method. In the third method, you have to enable safe mode first. For that, again, do the same process to reach to Windows Automatic or Advanced Repair options. Turn off and on the laptop or PC three times to trigger automatic repair or see Advanced Repair options. Click on See Advanced Repair Options. After that, click on Troubleshoot. Click on Advanced Options. Now, here click on Startup Settings. Click on Restart to enable the Windows Safe Mode. Press F4 or F5 to enable Windows Safe Mode. I am going to press F5 to enable Safe Mode with Networking option. This will take you to Windows Safe Mode. Search for Control Panel and then click on it to open Control Panel. Click on Programs and Features. Now here it shows you all the programs which are installed on your PC or laptop. Just uninstall that program which trigger this error while using or uninstall the recently installed program which causes this issue. After that restart and check your problem solve or not. If still not, then uninstall the recent Windows update. Sometimes faulty or corrupt Windows update may cause this type of issue.
You can also roll back the display driver because some time windows updates the display drivers and cause this type of issue. So just go to Device Manager. Expend Display Adapters. Now here, select any previous working version of display drivers and then click on Next button. Once done, restart your laptop or PC. This time you will not see your device ran into a problem error while using Windows. If you find my video helpful, then don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. Thanks for watching.